Uh, how much I so I I just have the the bag of candy that I got to hand out for tonight. So nowhere near one hundred and eight dollars for me. Um, but I kept things a bit more modest for any of the trick or treaters. Uh, uh, stop by my way for tonight. Should be cool and dry out there. Dry being the uh, key word for tonight. So no worries for any kind of rain or snow. Don't have to waterproof the costumes out there for tonight. Uh, the rain returns on Thursday. A lot of focus going into the very wet early November outlook. But for today, pretty quiet pattern for the Pacific Northwest. And this little bit of cloud cover might actually help us out tonight to keep those temperatures just in the low 40s and upper 30s, at least above the freezing mark for most of us, even into those early evening hours. Highs will be close to 50 degrees. 49 is kind of an interesting number because that is the exact average high temperature for Halloween and that's just what we're forecasting for today. So what you come to expect for a Halloween night over the years is what we're getting for today. Temperatures at 5 o'clock about 46 degrees and then dropping to about 36 by 9 o'clock at night. But even that is still above the freezing mark thanks to a bit of that cloud cover. We'll see again important thing. No rain, no snow, no precipitation for tonight. Any of that holds off until Wednesday night at the earliest and more likely Thursday as we'll see our next storm systems parade into the Pacific Northwest. You're going to see this semi permanent low pressure area just swirl around the North Pacific. It doesn't hit us, but it's going to guide any other storms on the outside of it straight into the Pacific Northwest. So there's that Thursday system, and then the next one comes in on Saturday. There's likely going to be another wave Sunday into Monday. So between three storm systems in the next week, looks like we could get a full inch of rain, maybe more in some areas of the inland Northwest. Definitely a lot more out west where you see about two to three inches of rain for Seattle and the Puget Sound. But yeah, this is again three different storm systems, maybe a third or a half an inch of rain each. It's a very wet weather pattern for us, but it's all rain, no snow because of how mild these storm systems are going to be. They're coming out of the central Pacific, not north Pacific. So our temperatures actually increase just a little bit, just subtly into the low 50s for this weekend. So all that stays as rain, but there will be plenty of it.